beloved in Christ. On this blessed third Sunday of Easter, we gather to immerse ourselves in the light of Christ's resurrection, as recounted in today's readings. From the Acts of the Apostles, 3 colon 13-15, 17-19, we hear Peter's bold proclamation to the people. He calls them to recognize their ignorance in denying Jesus and to embrace the path of repentance and conversion. This passage challenges us to acknowledge our own failings and to seek God's mercy, which brings about the renewal of our lives. The responsorial psalm, Ps 4 colon 2, 4, 7 to 8, 9, echoes with a plea for God's grace and the assurance of His joy and peace. It is a reminder that, in the midst of our trials, we can rest securely in the Lord's presence, for He alone brings tranquility to our souls. In the second reading from 1 John, 2 colon 1 5a, we are comforted by the knowledge that we have an advocate in Jesus Christ, who is the atonement for our sins. This passage invites us to live in fidelity to God's commandments, for in doing so, the love of God is perfected within us. The Gospel of Luke, 24 35-48, presents the awe-inspiring encounter of the disciples with the risen Lord. Jesus dispels their fears and opens their minds to understand the Scriptures. He calls us, too, to recognize Him in the breaking of bread and to be witnesses of His resurrection. Let us, therefore, rejoice in the hope of the resurrection. Let us turn away from sin and be faithful to the gospel. May the light of Christ's resurrection shine upon us and guide us to eternal life. Amen. Welcome to our YouTube channel. If you're new here, we're all about sharing engaging content that you won't want to miss. So, if you enjoy our videos, don't forget to like, share, and comment below to support us. Your interaction not only helps our channel grow but also tells us what content you love to see. Thanks for stopping by, and we hope you subscribe and join our community. God bless you always.